Okay, continuing to map, uh, making my way through Hatikva's faith. Hatikva's, it's kind of hard to say. And uh, yet again, being chased down by pirates, so it's the theme of the day. Pirate bounty auto autopilot activated. Unfortunately, this is pirates' territory, so I'm not going to really get anything for this other than not dying. Bounty Hunter, Harrier, Hauler, you are being promoted. Oh yeah, there is the basic combat rank. I guess I'm still getting that. That's a good thing. Alert, missile closing. NMMC, Escort, Buzzard, Vanguard. Okay, the rest is Boron, so... I'm going to get back to mapping, head on up into uh, split space and see if I can make some friends up there. And be back in a bit. Okay, continuing my mapping through Hetikva's Faith and going into Turok's Beard. And of course, Auto, auto getting chased by pirates. Auto pilot on. All right, hopefully I can actually get some mapping done this time. I'll be back. Okay, I've almost escorted my Dolphin Super Freighter down to the bottom of Aquila's Beacon in preparation to take him down to Legend's home once I have the reputation for it to sell him. And it uh, looks like I have a potential mission here that I might be able to do. This yep. should be easy. Does it interest okay, you? protect station, very easy. So I'm going to go ahead and take this. Not really for the money, because it's insignificant, but uh, again, the reputation gains, which right now I need a lot of. And uh, I'm doing this knowing that my dolphin is en route, but Auto I think that uh, since it's very easy, yeah, it shouldn't be much more than one or two small ships. So again, a real quick uh, reputation grab. Pirate, Harrier. And I'm going to pause this and I'll be back when we're into it. Alright, yeah, a few more than I thought. Uh, but they're all pretty small ships. So it should be easy. I'm still trying to keep an eye on my hauler to make sure that uh, none of them get any bright ideas. Pirate, Harrier, Hauler. On behalf of our President and Senator, the Argon Federation thank you for your help with this invader. You have gained recognition. On behalf of our President and Senator, Argon Federation, thank you for your help with this and invader. Because it's a uh, defense station Target mission, even though I don't have a police license, I'm still getting a bonus per ship killed during the mission. And once you get the police license, of course, you get uh, you get paid every time you kill one of the enemies of the race um, who you're protecting, or the current sector that you're in. All right, let's speed this up a little bit here. I will get missiles as soon as I can, which will greatly speed this up when you have these tiny little ships that just scoot around you really quick. You did a great job. Transferring your money now. You have okay. gained recognition. Mission completed. Again, the uh, pay was insignificant, but 
this was worth it all. My uh, Argon reputation just went way up. So I'm going to continue doing this, moving the ship down, my uh, Dolphin, getting it ready to uh, go down into Legends Home to sell, and continue doing some mapping and working on uh, relations with uh, the different races. So uh, I'll be back. Okay, I've made it down to Legend's home after spending a bit of time increasing my reputation with the Argon and uh, basically just the station defense mission and a few more pirates uh, that came through afterwards. And uh, now I'm able to, uh, to enter this sector so I sent my Dolphin ahead and then escorted it to the shipyard here in Legend's home. I'm going to go ahead and well, first of all, I also sent the Mistral Super Freighter to the trading station, which sells uh, engine and steering upgrades, but of course I don't have any money right now, so as soon as I sell this Dolphin, well, I have 3000 so as soon as I sell the Dolphin, I'll have some operating cash, so we're going to go ahead and do that. And again, you see that everything in this station, in this shipyard, is red to me because... Um, my standing is just too low right now, but we're going to fix that very quickly, especially once I get the Super Freighter doing some trading in addition to uh, my missions and um, clearing out pi uh, pirates. So let's go ahead and sell this ship. One point almost two million, and that's a really good first paycheck. Dolphin sold. All right. Now that looks a little better. So now I have some funding to upgrade the Super Freighter and upgrade my Mamba. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and do that now. Uh, pick up some uh, trading extension for my Mamba so that I can do trading, of course, remotely. And uh, pick up just a couple of extra things and I'll be back when that's done. And we'll see you there. Okay, I've done a little shopping around, and I think I'm just one rank short of being able to buy most of what I need. Uh, but either way, I don't have the reputation to buy an additional 25 megajoule shield for my Mamba yet. So it's kind of frustrating. So I'm looking for missions that I can do and the occasional pirate wandering in. But I do have the funds, and um, well, let's just take a quick look at what I did grab. Um, I went ahead and put a jump drive on my Mamba and I expanded my uh, cargo and my rudder optimization to max so that uh, I can hold more energy cells for jumping and I stand a better chance of dodging missiles and that kind of thing. I also put a uh, triplex scanner on so that I can see more while I'm personally exploring until I can afford an explorer ship. Excuse me. So. Let's pull up the uh, Super Freighter since I have the trade extension and uh, do some remote trading for him. Definitely going to go ahead and upgrade. I'm down to less than a million, 962,000. So I'm going to keep an eye on that. I'm going to upgrade the engine tuning for sure because it's way too slow. Installed. Same thing with rudder. rudder optimization. Now, Installed. I obviously can't upgrade his cargo to max if I were to do this. You would see I can't even go barely over halfway and it takes all of my money, so we're not going to do that. Um, the more cargo you buy, the more expensive it becomes. So what I'm going to do is buy uh, as much as I can without severely cutting into my funds because I want to have a lot of money to trade with and continue to buy uh, more equipment as my rank improves. Right now I can't even buy HEPs or uh, pretty much any of the weapons or shields I want. So. I'm going to keep some money around, and I think maybe an extra thousand on the cargo will be enough for now. It'll keep me about eight hundred thousand in the bank. Cargo bay extension. And um, I'm still going to pick up a couple of upgrades for him that I don't think he has. Yeah, currently no shields, uh, no lasers, no missiles, and no trading software. So I've got a little bit of upgrading to do on him yet. But I uh, just wanted to grab a little bit of video to show, you know, there's a whole lot going on behind the scenes and it's very time consuming. So, all right, I am going to um, go take down a few more pirates and run a few simple missions. I'm not going to capture every one of them. You've already seen, you know, one of the very simple uh, ship capturing missions. Uh, the kill missions are the same. You just hunt down the target one or two jumps away 
And uh, so I'm going to do that, work on my rep until I can buy some shields and weapons, and then I'll be back when I've done that. Okay, I misspoke um, earlier when I said I wanted to get up into split space uh, because they have a ship that I wanted to buy specifically for um, for exploring, but it's the Kestrel and that's actually a Talati ship. And of course I don't have the standing for Talati, and they're a very profit-based race, so they're not usually fighting any of the other races, so I... Uh, I can't get any combat missions, but it seems that they want to offer me a lot of scan rock missions. So, I'm going to go scan some asteroids <laughs> and get my reputation up with uh, Talati until I can get my ship trading up here. So, um, that's the plan. I guess that sounded pretty negative. For those of you who have an entrepreneurial spirit and want to realize future potential profits through scanning of va uh, valuable minerals, this mission may be for you. So anyways, I'm going to go take care of this and I'll be back. Okay, to speed things up with getting enough reputation that I can get the ball really rolling here, um, I've decided to go ahead and manually, or I should say remotely trade with my Mistral Super Freighter even before I've had a chance to put uh, shields on him. and that's something I wouldn't normally do because one bad bump at a gate or at a station can blow the ship up so I'm gonna take my chances and I went ahead and docked both ships transferred my jump drive over to the uh, freighter rather than make him haul it up through all of these uh, sectors and uh, jumped him up to company pride which is a small sector with uh, uh, several products that trade well so I'm going to manually trade with him in the meantime I'm going to restock the jump drive that I gave to the freighter because I like being able to move around quickly jump drive installed. and uh, still don't have the standing to buy the 25 megajoules so I think I'm gonna fix that pretty quickly with uh, with the trading yeah go ahead and pick up a satellite I've been At looking for those Alright, um, I have the super freighter docking at a solar power plant which at the time of the order was trading energy for 12 and it still is. So uh, I'm going to get the first few moments of trading here captured because that's when the, the ranks start going up fairly quickly in the beginning because you have so far to go and then it levels out. So I'm going to try to capture a bit of this the original, uh, not the original, but the initial upstart, and then I'll slow down the pace of capture. So I'll be back when he's uh, docked. Okay, I'm going to try my hand at multitasking here. You are talking. If a good time, do you want the job? This is an average difficulty, and that's kind of hit or miss with me, especially with a, uh, a ship with um, the default wares. So the two heps and uh, my one shields. I'm not sure if this is going to work, but I'm going to take it anyway, so we'll give it a try because there's no time limit. But, um... Okay, so basically I'm going to have to go to the beginning sector and then yes, escort this convoy back. And uh, while I'm doing this, I'll keep an eye on the freighter and uh, manage some remote trading while trying to run this mission. So. Okay, again, pause until uh, something changes here. Okay, I've just got an incoming message from my freighter. He's docked and the energy is still dirt cheap. I am going to buy everything I can afford or that will fit, which is quite a lot, at 12. Which leaves me no money, energy but Ball. energy should be easy to trade. And, uh... Yeah, that was an easy promotion because I bought so much. Now I didn't have a chance to um, put the best buys and best sells on him and I regret that right now, but uh, this isn't too bad because there's not too many places in um, the sector. As a matter of fact, there's one that's really close by, Taladium. So uh, let me just check one more that's close. 
Yeah, the Teladium place is uh, buying at 18, so I'm going to try to grab that real quick. That'll be a very nice first profit. Stalking granted. Command accepted. Okay. And again, I'll pause while uh, the traveling is happening. Okay, en route to my mission, and I just got another message from the freighter. He has landed at the Teladium factory, and looks like timing is good. They're still buying at 18. Probably not everything I have, but a good bit. Energy cells sold. And that was a nice profit, as well as um, an increase in my standing with Talati. So I'm going to go ahead and look for some more buyers for energy. And uh, again, I'll be back when something is updated. Okay, still en route to my mission. Autopilot off. And uh, another no notification from Super Freighter. He's landed. Yep, okay, not quite as good of a price, but it's still a profit of four each. And more importantly, um, that'll still give me a standing increase with the Talati. So we'll sell all but enough to jump with. Energy cells sold. You have gained recognition. Yeah, okay, already another promotion with two trades, so it's definitely going to uh, speed things up. Okay, I'm going to continue uh, doing this until I get to um, the start point for this mission, and then I'll chime back in with, with video, and I'll see you there. Okay, I finally got to the, uh, the goal here, all the way at Hatikva's Fate. So I've got a uh, good four jumps, three or four jumps to uh, escort this guy, make sure he makes it. Sometimes I've seen that these things are hit and miss. When it's average, it usually assesses the difficulty based on the ship you're in, but um, I'm not so sure it always takes into account the equipment and gear on the ship. So um, I'm hoping this is going to be within my uh, my grasp because it will be a nice boost to, to rep and uh, working my way up the mission chain so that I can get more profitable missions. And... It looks like it's already starting. I'm not sure if these guys are part of the uh, mission or not. So I'll keep an eye on them. And uh, I'll come back in with the video when uh, any action starts. Okay, that was quick. Boron, freight transpirate, discoverer, hauler. And they literally Target came out of nowhere. That's okay, bail on your ship. Attention, energy low. I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> More drama. Pirate, buzzard, vanguard. Pirate, harrier, hauler. Yeah, they're already putting some dent in the shields. So I'm not sure how many of these waves I'll get, but this could actually be a little bit of a challenge. At least it's fun. Target is now in fire. <laughs> okay. And again, I'll uh, I'll pause while we're traveling. Argo autopilot activated. 
Okay, yeah, this has been going on for a bit. Um, unfortunately, I lost one of the ships, and I thought I uh, failed the mission, but I guess there's several in the convoy, and as long as at least one is alive, the mission's ongoing. Target is now in firing range. And I guess you get a bonus per ship that makes it, I'm assuming. So, yeah, this has kind of been non-stop. These little guys can be a real pest, and... Pirate Discoverer. I've Raider. been following him and thinking he would use common sense and just go through the gate, but he just kind of hangs around until, um, I guess enough of these guys attack. I don't know. Attention. Energy low. But it's a little bit more exciting than scanning asteroids. <laughs> so. No aim. Asteroid. Our autopilot activated. Okay, again. Back to it. Okay, yeah. Next sector, uh, a few seconds in, and it starts again. On behalf of our president and senator, the Argon Federation thank you for your help with this invader. Okay, Buster, more of the same. Vanguard, Argo, the uh, the escort continues. Discoverer, Vanguard. Well, I certainly wouldn't call this an easy mission, I guess. Mosquito missile installed. Okay, well, this is going to be a simple fight. It's just going to take a little while, so go ahead and pause the video and uh, rejoin in just a little bit. Target the autopilot off. On behalf of our president and senator, the Argon Federation, thank you for your help with this invader. Target is now in firing range. Flail Missile Production Facility, Alpha. Argon Autopilot Activated. Okay, uh, there were several more waves. I'm sure you didn't want to see all of them, but I think we finally just jumped into the target sector. I'm not sure if the Legends reward home. comes automatically or if we have to make it all the way to the station. And uh, it looks like we have to make it all the way there. Pirate Buster. Okay, I'm gonna pause again until we get there. Target all right, looks like a grand finale here. Pirate. This should be fun. Vanguard. Just hope I can get them all quickly enough. Target is now in Knowing my luck, I'll go through all of that and they'll take down the ship and I'll lose the mission. Pirate Discoverer Hauler. Pirate Discoverer Vanguard.
pirate discoverer hauler target left incoming message finally okay well that will certainly help the standing a bit and um, I'll edit this down a little bit I guess I'm speaking after the fact but uh, to make sure that it's not quite so tedious okay I'm gonna dock save my place and take a pause in the uh, video capture <laughs>